the latest research that I conducted in collaboration with Samsung Electronics in Europe, we found that the average European performs seven household tasks per week. When you add those tasks up, they add to about 30 hours per week. That is almost a full-time job. This combined, we have come to call the invisible load. A load that deprives you of the time and energy to, to do the things that actually matter, to spend time with your loved ones or, you know, to develop yourself or to even just relax and enjoy your time. Think of all the time that you waste, you know, worrying about things that haven't been done at home or, you know, planning for things to be done or even just doing the actual physical work itself and all of the effort that goes through this. And think about how that impacts on your state of stress. Interestingly, more than half of the participants in our research said that they were stressed more than half of the time. Now that needs to change. This is why I teamed up with Samsung, because together we could build a tool, we call it the Invisible Load Index, that will give you a score that will help you understand the impact of those tasks on your life and your level of stress, but also it will help you understand how your precious time is being wasted. And wasted here is the key word, because 90% of the participants told us that they believed they could be more efficient at I agree with that. I mean, I personally use smart devices. I automate tasks in my household so that they happen on time without my supervision, even when I'm traveling halfway around the world. It works. It really saves me time. It saves me stress because I know, even when I'm traveling, that my home is performing exactly how I expect it to. I urge you to calculate your invisible load index understand the impact of household tasks on your life, and then perhaps join me in that idea of automating whatever you can using smart devices or the Samsung uh, SmartThings app, and see how much improvement you can get. My task here, the task that I really want us to prioritize, is for you to find balance, whether that's physically, mentally, uh, or emotionally, when you spend that wonderful time, that comfortable time that you're supposed to spend 